Welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be playing Crash of Clans. And and we're going to be playing Crash of Clans and I'm going to be showing you how to be making the best bases. Like I will show you how to make a base just like this one on the screen. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. I'll teach you how to make a godly base. Okay? This is going to be part one of showing you how to make good bases. Okay. So. So. Today, I am going to be showing you how to make good bases. So. To make a good base, you should always have. A design like something in your head that you really want do you want your base to look cool or do you not care about how your base looks you just care about um, you have a base that works depends what type of base you want I like a base that looks good and really and really cool and and works and effective and, and always wins so since I had this base I was winning every single battle right when I got this base. So this base is overpowered. So so I'll tell you how I got this idea. I'll tell you how I get all my bases. So if you go to attack, you go to practice. Um if you're a starter and if you're in if like you're in the game like town hall 12 or almost town hall 14, still go to the practices. And look at it. It's a perfect example. I copied down this base. I just look at it and then I build my base. So like for this base, um, I just copy it down and and then I and then I try to build it. And so if you see on the upper on the on the, on the, on the on the down right side of my screen, um, above shop, you see this button. Um, you can go here and edit your bases. So you go edit layout, and then hit remove all. So now you have all this stuff in your inventory. So put your town hall down, finish later, and then go back to practice. And if you don't remember, just keep on doing this. So... You have to do so here defense 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 elixir and then dark elixir so you just keep on doing this and copy down the base easiest way trust me that's the that's the main way i agree i agree that that is the best way to to make the best base and number two farming bases you you if you are above like Town Hall 10, I'm not, but I still have one, you should make a design for a farming base. Farming base is for, not, it's not really to protect you, it's just to farm, like, if you have everything. So, I'll show you one of, a farming base is like, you have like all the same stuff together, like, like, all the, like, Every like every all, everything outside of the walls like your town hall is out of the wall and keep everything else inside the walls because you just want them to get the town hall and then leave because you just want to level up and and level up the town hall and you don't really want to fight. It's called a farming base. The second reason and and I recommend for you to just join a clan. Join a clan. When you join that clan, go to your clan, my clan. So I am in the silver right here. So how about I look at this kid's face? Who is it? Okay, you see his face, pretty nice. There's this thing on the upper right hand of my screen. It says Copy layout. Hit that. Then it would automatically copy your layout. 
hit one of these, we hit the empty one. Okay, now you just copied their whole base. That easy. Just join a clan and you get a free base. I never knew this. I just learned this yesterday. So, yeah. And it's pretty cool. So, yeah, just join a clan and if you don't have any level up, look at people's bases. Just copy them. You just copy layout. It's really that simple. Like, I never do that, but now you never have to copy up the practices. Just copy off other people. And you could just visit and copy anyways. You have to be in their clan to be able to copy. That's the only rule. So you need to you need to always be in a clan if you want to have the good base. You might be copying. But it's worth it for a good base. So let's visit this guy. Wait, my clan. Let's visit. Okay. So okay, so she so this is a good base, so I bought a visit. So in the upper right hand of my corner, I've copy layout. So a few minutes ago it was orange, now it's gray. That means you do not have the right stuff to copy this layout. So you would usually look at her base, see what you don't have, and then try to get it. But I would just try to copy people in your clan. No offense, but I, I, I never do it, but some people need to. Like people that don't know how to make a base, like starters should copy from people's clans. Just copied this clan, and I don't get how this is a good base. Maybe you shouldn't copy people because sometimes their um, bases are not really that good. So, yeah, I wouldn't copy them like as a normal thing, but hey, just, just something for you to know. This is my main base, nothing too good. And this base is from the practice room, like I showed you. And, and, and if you guys never knew this, there's a ship. I, I always knew this, but um, I recommend if you need gems really bad, upgrade this thing. Upgrade this. You get gems. Gems. So you would be getting 2.4 gems every day. And I already collect my gems. And the more you upgrade, the more gems you get. So it's just free gems you're getting. And that's what I'm really doing. I just want to upgrade that. I'm going to try to attack. So, so if you're ever trying to get coins in this game mode, you always want to have the archers. I'll tell you why. Archers are invisible for like, I don't know, like eight seconds. So use them to attack the towers. Like, they don't see it, so you can't keep to them. And now they just dominated that, that thing. So now I can pick on the goblins, but now we have to take out this. So, yeah. Goblin down. Probably not going to get a three star, but. Yeah, I'm not going to get a three star. Because uh, they're, they're still the middle tower. You see right here the middle tower? Um, just to be where she, she, can, she can kill air and ground and that's very important and if you guys are having problems like like you think like, i have enough gold but it won't let me level up if you hit level up you can see you need all of these things to level up so that's another thing that people need to know and and, and it's always the red icon the places where you need more stuff. So right now I am going to get ooh. might take it two days, but so ground in air. So I have one right here. I recommend 
always getting these guys because I'm at an expo because they are so overpowered. Expos are really good. And you should always, you should always have an expo in your base if your town hall not. They're recommended. You cannot say they're not recommended. So, wait. Okay. Okay. Maybe I should try to attack. Wait, do I have any spells? Okay, all spells. Okay. Try to see if I can find something. Ooh. No, no, no. No. I need gold and elixir and dark elixir. I just need a juicy base. A juicy base to attack. Ooh. No, that wouldn't do a dent. I'm still gonna make in the millions. No. Might have to attack the goblins to be able to get any loot, because. They're not gonna give me anything. Come on, just a base that has like a million coin. Come on, just, just need a very. Ooh, I know. Um, I can get revenge. No, in battle. No. Love this revenge. Oh. Why is it online? Ooh. Yeah, I'm going to try to attack this. Oh, I have no idea. Yeah, I'm not going to be able to get much loot, but I might not be able to pre-start, but that's fine. At least I got revenge. Got defeated. I should have had more spells. Yeah. Should have had more spells. Hmm. Ooh. Um, whoa, it's a lot. Hmm, up with Archer Queen. Yeah, the Archer Queen kind of needs it more. This one, Bro, the best for the king is, we all know, him and him. <laughs> yeah, but, yeah, it's really, what our good bases are just copying down from practice rounds copying off your clan don't tell your clan but those are the ways you can copy off bases or build your own base and another thing is 
just as fun. Try to make your own base instead of copying it. I didn't co copy this base off the practice round. Didn't copy it from a real human. But, yeah.